Max Grover, an 18-year-old freshman at LSU, died one month after moving into his new dorm room during a fraternity initiation at Phi Delta Theta. I don't like to impose penalties, but in that case, uh, if you see something, say something. I'm... LSU's Greek Task Force has been trying to make a change by holding a series of meetings. One was held on February 31, 2018 at 4.30 at the LSU Foundation Building. During this meeting, they discussed possible changes like forming a standing committee to review all Greek-related policies, prevention and punishment of hazing through approved events, and establishing a better amnesty policy to give people the help they need faster. When asked if these changes were brought on by Groover's passing, the Associate Vice President at Dean of Students at LSU agreed. I think Max Groover was the, the final straw. I think. I, again, I think throughout the United States, you've, you've seen and heard uh, communities ask for something different. And then when it's in your backyard and it's so painful, um, it becomes the catalyst to really make changes. So I think some of us have wanted to change this for a while, but uh, the unfortunate passing of Max gave the entire community the reason to say, okay, let's stop and look at it. The Greek task force is keeping the Groover family posted on any revisions as they mourn their son, and our hearts certainly does go out to them. Reporting from LSU, I'm Courtney Brown.